Hey Dad, what's for tea? Food. What kind of food? Edible food. What kind of edible food? Edible food you can eat. Dad. Dad. Welcome to another episode of What's for Tea, Dad. Where tonight we're making fettuccine marinara. <laughs> Let's get into it. What's for tea, Dad? What's for tea? What's for tea, Dad? What's for tea? Miserable weather. Let's go home and cook the dinner. For this meal, you're only going to want four things. You need a kilo of marinara mix from your supermarket. I've got 1.4 kilos here because my kids are older, but a kilo is pretty good and there's leftovers for dad. You're also going to want a jar of tomato spag bog sauce. This is the Dolmio one. I like the taste of this one in the marinara. Got extra tomato, and extra garlic, and extra onion. You're also going to want a packet of fettuccine. Onion. You're going to want a skillet. But this is a walk. This will do. Grab yourself a bloody big pot. Fill him up with water. Got to get the water to boil before we put in the fettuccine. Got to do it first. The fettuccine, your mouth, nah, nah. That'll do, son. Put him over here. <laughs> the bloody light fell down. <laughs> Turn on your hot plate. That one, that one. I don't have to bang it anymore. Grab your lid, bang him on. And grab your onion, you know what to do here. End for end, round the middle, rip his skin off. Not the waste in the bin. Chop him up, time to start chopping. Watch your fingies. Slice him along here. Until she's all done. Last one. Good onion. Ha. Wanna get a little bit of your old befriended mate? Olive oil, chuck him in there. Turn on the hot plate. Then chuck all that onion. Don't forget Spoony McSpoon face. Start mixing him in. Get it mushed and smushed with all that beautiful oil. Look my precious. Now this meal's super quick. That's why you gotta get that water on. It's a great one for when you're really busy and you're like, oh crap, what am I going to do for tea, Dad? You're getting close, but he's not there yet. Get that marinara into there, starting to cook. Right, open him up and just swap her in. <laughs> and now mix him up. So we don't need to cook this for long because it all overcooks really, really fast. Basically, we want to just give him time to cook that onion a bit more because very shortly, it'll be time for the Dolby or Green. <laughs> Mixing up. You get a lot of juice come out of this stuff. That juice we want to keep because it's delicious. It's just going to mix in with that sauce. Super nice. She's nearly boiled. Get rid of that. Chucking in a bit of olive oil or any oil into the water. It's going to help the fettuccine stop sticking. And a bit of salt, because that's what the bros do. Turn down your marinara to a simmer. Chuck in the dolmio. Blunk. Look at that. <coughs> Keep the jar for mince. Grab your fettuccine, cut off the top, chuck him in there, mix in your sauce and your marinara. Now the rest of this marinara that didn't cook will cook slowly as the pasta sauce gets hot. While that's cooking, now you don't have to, but part of a dad's staple addition to tomato bolognese, in this case it's a marinara. A little bit of this and a little bit of this makes it taste like this and this had babies. Sweet soy. People laugh at me when I say I put sweet soy in stuff. Not as salty as regular soy. I think it's better. It's good with everything. Bit of me old mate, Marty sauce. Now there's a fair bit of sauce there. Now mix him in. Whoa. She looks good. Grab a fork and just give this fettuccine a bit of a stir. Because he's a sticky bugger and he'll stick to the bottom and he'll stick to each other like it has now. Oi donkey! <laughs> yeah, I'll chuck a lid on him and see if I can get him to boil nice and rapid. And mix this stuff. Now, because he looks cooked to me, if you get a bit of fish out, the fish looks cooked. Give him another stir. 
try and break up all those bits of fettuccine. Now, the fettuccine I've always find takes about sometimes 10 minutes in the boil, depending on how al dente you like it. I like it al dente. Now turn down your marinara, put it down on low. Keep a boiling. Check on your pasta. Grab a bit. Gonna be hot. Woohoo! See if she's cooked. Mm -hmm. She's good. It's just how I stand like it. Turn him off. Let's drain that. Pop him on the corner of your sink. Grab your lid. Drain it. Come on, you little buggers. Stay in there. Buy a colander, mate. Buy a colander. Nah. Final grain. That'll do. Grab your bowls. One, two, three, four. You're gonna need a pair of tongs for this one. <laughs> Lid off. First bowl. Grab some of your pasta. Chuck him in there. Second bowl. Chuck him in there. Third bowl. Chuck him in there. Fourth bowl. Chuck him in there. Grab your dish or upper. And then just start spooning him on. Bang, look at that. Fettuccine marinara. He's delicious. If you've got a ladle, you can put a bit of the juices from the bottom, the sauce, in on top. Delicious. Dad likes a bit of chilli in his. Some chilli seeds. Just a couple. Some chilli powder. Chuck a fork in him. Good to go. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. I was going to give this marinara a bit of a go. She's hot. Fettuccine. Mmm. Oh, fettuccine marinara. If you like these videos, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit the like button. Maybe hit subscribe too. It goes a long way for me. See you next time.